you alone? Or a When you ask yourself, who am I? Have you ever wondered who's asking the question? You have a soul. What makes you joyful? Do you have a life purpose? Why? Welcome to the Chopra Well. My goal today is to educate, enlighten and entertain because Vinny G is here and he's the ultimate entertainer. Vinny, thanks for coming by. It's an honor to be here. Congratulations on your book. Thank you so much. Uh, once again, the title is? Uh, Control the Crazy. Control the Crazy. It's a New York Times bestseller. Yep. So congratulations again. Thank you. So tell me, why did you write this book and what was the original motivation? What do you expect people to get out of it? I, uh, for the past couple of years, I've read a lot of books, um, including your books, <laughs> to try to just, um, just, just be happy, feel happy and, and not feel anxious. And I took whatever I learned from these books and I, um, I'm just sharing it with, with my, um, my people, the people that watch me and, and younger people and just everybody, you know, that just wants to hear um, how, I, how this message relates to myself and how I overcame. Obviously, a lot of people um, in your generation and your colleagues must be going through, because, uh, through this because you've certainly hit a chord and the book is, as I said earlier, Mm -hmm. on the bestseller list, so you're yeah. reaching a lot of people and yeah. hopefully they're benefiting from it. So Don't you're going to have a schizophrenic life, a cheesy yeah. kind of uh, persona here and enlightening exactly. Well, hair. I try to combine both worlds. There's a lot of negativity on my show, so I always try to uh, give advice to all my housemates when things are going bad and they, they look to me for some reason. Good. Um, oh, good. But that's why they were, they were scared last time when I was going through it because, you know, they were like, Vinny's the one that gives us advice when we're feeling down. So, uh, but there's a reason why I know all this stuff is because I read all these books because it, I needed it for no, myself. I think it's great. What you struggle with can be a teacher for you and then you can show other people yeah. how you overcame those obstacles. Mm -hmm. Now, can I ask you some questions? Um, I would love that, please. Close your eyes. Put your attention in your heart. And I'm just going to ask you a question. Don't think. Just say mm -hmm. whatever comes to your mind. Who are you? Vinny. What if you didn't have the name Vinny? Then who would you be? Consciousness. Good for you. What do you want? To be happy all the time. What do you want? Enlightenment. Wow. Good one. See, there's something beyond happiness. Mm -hmm. um, what's your life purpose? To figure out my life's purpose. Do you want to make a contribution to the world? Yes, I want to make people happy and do good things for other people, including my family and with the platform I have now, as many other people as I could. Could that be your life purpose? Could be. What does a meaningful relationship mean to you? Love. Somebody who you end up putting them first before yourself. Great. Do you have any heroes in history, mythology, religion? Michael Jordan. Good for you. Okay, because there are certain traits in him that you want. That's great. Um, what are your unique uh, skills and talents? I, I do art. I write. I act. So you should focus on those skills and always ask yourself, who's benefiting? What would really make you joyful? To go through the things that I go through in my crazy life, like flying and traveling and filming without ever you know, feeling negative about it and anxious about it. I want to go through it. So make a to commitment to do that at some point. Do you believe in God? In some way, yes. Do you have a soul? Yes. Where is it? Inside of me. Well, you're wrong, but never mind. Um, you do have a soul, but it's not inside your body. Uh, but that's another conversation. Do you think about death? Yes. What does it mean to you? I think like most of all my, like a lot of my fears are ultimately a fear of death. So remember, death is entering the unknown, which is always known to you. It's happening right now. The past is gone. It's not here. It's dead. 
So St. Paul said, die unto death and you'll be renewed. Remember that. When you ask yourself, who am I? Uh, have you ever wondered who's asking the question? Well, I do ask myself that a lot. And you said, I'm Vinny, and I guess your answer is, Vinny is asking the question. Yep. But you went beyond that. You said consciousness earlier. Yes. So congratulations. Is the universe a noun or a verb? A verb. Good for you. Are you a noun or a verb? A verb. That's it. You got it, man. You're going to be enlightened very soon. Yeah, I hope so. <laughs>